talk about my game plan because um, as my vlog watchers know, I have decided to enter a transformation challenge. It's a total transformation. It's for fitness. You know what? I think 2018 is going to be the year that I just smash my goals. And actually, no, I don't think. I know. So here's my plan. Yes, I have seizures. Yes, I have anxiety, depression. I have all these issues. And exercise will help with the anxiety and depression. But the seizures, that's the thing I have to be careful of when I'm exercising because I can't exhaust myself too much because I've done that before where I've exhausted myself too much and I've ended up having a seizure at the gym on a treadmill. <laughs> Luckily, I was okay. That was actually one of my lesser injuries, surprisingly enough. But the thing is, with caution in mind, I'm also going to push myself harder than I have ever before because this time I actually want to achieve this goal. I want to, I want to smash this goal. Okay. I want to not just lose weight because lose weight. You can, you can lose muscle mass too and lose weight, but I want to lose body fat percentage because with all this extra fat on my body, I have so many back problems. I have issues with ovarian cysts and women who are overweight who have um, too much fat content in their body have a higher uh, risk of ovarian cysts and that's exactly why I have them. I'm 189 pounds. I did, I did the weighing yesterday and the fact that I'm 189 pounds is insane. I can remember a couple months ago, I was 165 pounds or something. And in those months, I gained 24 pounds. That is insane. The fact that I see my mom struggling as well is a great motivator. Because I know that if I continue like this, I'm going to get to not just her weight, but bigger. Because I'm also taller than her. It's depressing, okay? So I, I, just, I just don't want to have to deal with that. And I don't want to have any complications. Uh, if I do choose in the future to have a child and I mean birth in general is a huge risk for any mother it's your health like do you want to live longer do you want to live happier do you want to be able to do things do you want to be able to explore the world do you want to be able to just be the best that you can be and be the happiest that you can be, well, you can't be overweight for that. Because the problem with being overweight is it prevents you from doing all these things. If you want to go explore and let's say take a trip to, I don't know, uh, Cuba, you can go horseback riding, you can, you can go swimming and I mean, you have to be careful for the for the jellyfish in the water. Still, you can you can go even sunbathing, but it gets really hot in Cuba, and you have to be able to be fit. Like my mom was winded just walking at a really slow pace when we were in Cuba, and even I was. That is something that was not even this past winter I'm not talking about this winter or last winter I'm talking about the winter before that I was winded while walking while just walking it sucks I want to be able to travel to Dubai I want to be able to go back to Poland visit Poland again 
I want to go to Germany. I want, I really want to visit Germany because Germany has apparently one of the biggest vegan festivals in the world. And I want to be able to experience that. I want to be able, maybe not climb Mount Everest because I'm not insane, but I want to be able to do things and explore different places on foot so I don't have to constantly have somebody carrying me around or something like that. Like I'm some kind of Arabian princess. I'm just, I'm just not the kind of person that wants to just sit around all day. Even if I do sit around all day, I am insane. I'm going insane in my head because I want to do things. I want to be able to physically be able to explore, to just enjoy life. The fact that I'm doing this, regardless of my epilepsy, regardless of my depression, regardless of my anxiety, you know, I am just going to smash this. I am going to be the fittest person ever. Okay, maybe not ever, but I'm going to be the fittest I have ever been. I am not going to let anything stop me, not even my seizures. If I have a seizure, I'm just going to deal with it. I'm sure I'm going to have my recovery time. I'm gonna, you know, have have the nap that is necessary. But next day, I am back at it. I am not going to stop myself. I am I'm not going to let anything stop me because I need this. I absolutely need this. I I don't just need this. I want this so badly. It's just insane to think that I'm 189 pounds. It's just, it's ridiculous. And sure, most of it has gone to my butt and to obviously my stomach and my arms. With a lot of work and eating right, that's part of the game plan. I am going to avoid junk food as much as I possibly can. Even if I go out to, let's say, a restaurant, I'm not gonna eat a salad, but I'm going to eat something healthy, not something that's like super greasy and that is going to set me back, you know? But I am going to eat super healthy and I'm going to avoid junk food. I may be a junk food vegan, but you know what? It's not worth having all this weight. I'm going to eat as healthy as possible. I'm going to work out every single day, no matter what. I'm just, I'm just gonna think about how happy I'm going to be and how, not just athletic, but how physically able I will be able to do, wait, did, I, did that make sense? You get it. How, how, much I will be physically able to do things and not just be tired all day or be feeling depressed all day and having horrible thoughts in my mind because with exercise it raises your dopamine levels. I doubt that it will completely go away but it will definitely help. This is the time so guys and gals, you've heard it here. You heard it on my vlog, if you watch my vlog. I'm going to be doing vlogs every single day. The health channel, this, this channel, and my comedy channel are going to stick to uh, the same schedule. But my vlog channel is going to be daily vlogs. It's going to be serving as sort of a, um, I guess, progress report. You'll see the difference by the end. So if you look at the first video from the 1st of January to I think it's going to be the 15th of April is when the challenge ends. If you look at the progress at the end of the challenge, obviously, because those videos haven't appeared yet. <laughs> if you look at the progress, you're going to be seeing a big difference. I'm going to see a big difference. I'm going to look at it 12 weeks, 15 weeks down the line, and 
now I'm going to be... Wow! Like, really? That used to be me? That's insane! Wow! If you have goals that you want to achieve, don't ever let anybody stop you. Unless those goals are harmful to yourself or to other people. If they're harmful, then let people stop you because, you know, we don't, we don't want that here. But if they're amazing goals and you have the game plan and you actually are going to achieve these goals, go ahead. Don't let anybody stop you, okay? Because I have let so many people stop me before. Not so much of saying, oh, you shouldn't exercise, blah, blah, blah. It's more of, uh, oh, <laughs> yeah, you're really going to lose weight. Okay, yeah. That is a real killer for the mood. This time, I'm not going to let that happen. I've started today. So achieve your goals. Be the best that you can be. I'm going to be the best that I can be. I can, I'm going to be the craziest, the best, even better than I can be. It's going to be awesome. I know 2018 is my year, okay? I don't think, I just know 2018 is my year, okay? If you like that, please come back for more. Like, subscribe, and be sure to tell your friends. I swear it's not a chore. I love you so much. Be sure to check out my other channels, my comedy channel, and my vlog channel. My comedy channel for more laughs on Thursdays, and my vlog channel to see what I'm up to every day. Be sure to check out my vlog channel because, girl, you don't want to miss this. Mm -hmm.